This is George from High Tech Legion. So we're going to take a look at the Shadow Rock Top Flow SR1 top-down cooler from Be Quiet. The Shadow Rock SR1 is the second offering that we're seeing from Be Quiet in the U.S., following up on the heels of the very, very successful Dark Rock Pro, which we took a look at earlier. Uh, looking at the box of the Shadow Rock, you get a good picture of the unit itself and a couple of features listed down below. 135 millimeter fan, very efficient cooling. Uh, it is a PWM Silent Wings fan, which we have seen is one of the best fans uh, on the market so far. Going around back, get a look at some more specifications as well as the line drawing. Uh, now taking a look at the specs, you can see it's only 126 millimeters tall with the fan installed. That's very, very short. So you're going to be able to fit this in just about any case. Uh, it's not going to fit obviously into HTPC cases, but at 126 millimeters tall, the uh, space factor is going to be far less of a concern. Uh, it's going to weigh in at only 654 grams and uh, the fan, 135 millimeter, of course, by 25 millimeter silent wings fan, 1500 RPM, uh, capable of 66.8 CFM at only 23.5 dB. That's going to be a lot of air movement with very, very little noise. Uh, we have seen this in the past from the silent wings fans that they do provide great air movement at very, very minimal noise levels. Getting a look at the SR1 itself, as you can see, top down cooler. Be Quiet logo emblazoned with the four heat pipes coming through the fin array. Going, moving around the back, as you can see, aluminum fin array with the jags and four 8mm heat pipes. Nice big heat pipes, going to be able to uh, dissipate quite a bit of heat. Solid copper contact plate with nickel plating. And polish to a nice shine, very good mill, no problems whatsoever there. As you can see, the Be Quiet SR1 uses a very, very thick fin, and they have a lot of spacing. You can clearly see the heat pipes right through. Um, the fan is clip-on. It can be mounted top or bottom, or you can use a dual fan if you like. The only thing being, if you're going to use a bottom fan or uh, the dual fan setup, the overhang over the RAM, you're going to need to make sure you have clearance for the RAM. But all in all, it's really a good looking piece and very, very sturdy from Be Quiet. The mounting kit for the SR1 is one we've seen before. Uh, let's start with the manual. So you can see it's well illustrated. The installation is very, very simple. Honestly, you could do it from the one exploited picture. As you see, you've got four pictures, LGA 1155, 1156, 1366, 775, AM2, AM3, and socket 754, 939, 940. Uh, one thing to note, this, the uh, SR1 does not come with a mounting kit for LGA 2011. Now, of course, it does go into quite a bit more detail as it goes along. Fully illustrated, full explanations included in the installation manual. Looking at the kit itself, multi-use backplate, Two sets of AMD retention brackets, one for 775 and 1366, one specifically for 1155, 1156. AMD brackets, four screws, and assorted washers and a small tube of thermal interface material. The Shadow Rock SR1 brings a lot to the table for a top-down cooler, uh, featuring the 135mm Silent Wings fan, lots of air movement, very quiet, four 8mm heat pipes, standing only 126 millimeters tall with the fan installed. Uh, without the fan, you're looking at right about 100 millimeters if you're going to go with a bottom mount on the fan as well. Um, solid copper contact block, nickel plated. Again, four 8 millimeter heat pipes. Great looking top-down cooler from Be Quiet. 